we didn't create. Boom. 136A, just like that. Navia has finally arrived into the game of Genshin Impact as a playable character. She is a Geo Claymore user, weirdly enough, that has some pretty interesting mechanics. However, do they live up to the billing? We're going to be trying her out and make a judgment ours. Navia is real and Navia is here. He's Geo. And he is also a Claymore character. Now, the Claymore part of her kit doesn't really matter that much. So how does Navia work exactly? Now, Navia is a pretty easy character to learn. All you need to really know about is her elemental skill, which uh, needs stacks. So when you see that those little bullets uh, next to her you know, icon whenever she's like running around and stuff, um, there's a maximum of three that you can get. And for each, you get a certain amount of quote unquote Rosula shard shots, right? Now for her elemental burst, super easy. You fire it off and then she does the cannon fire support damage. Each time it hits, you get an additional an additional stack for her elemental skill. So I think it would kind of be worth it to kind of invest in all of them, mainly focusing on the elemental skill. Now for her talents, it's really easy to kind of know what she does. For this one, you get 40% additional damage after using your elemental skill uh, for your normal attacks and plunging or whatever. And then for her second talent, also really easy to understand. Just have two party members in your party to give you 40% increased attack if they're different types, not Geo. And they can't be the same type. So, that'd be different type. Who do you get the most amount of damage in your Navia? Now, obviously, get this all the way to level 8, level 9, level 10. That's where you get a bunch of damage from. And that's, you know, where it is. It gets two instances of this, so it'll be a lot of damage dealt. And for weapon, obviously, it's really easy to get a wrong weapon going here um this weapon is okay because it does increase attack after being healed but it's not my favorite definitely not my favorite you really want to stack crit and attack on her that's how she'll do the most amount of damage you want geo damage and you want attack percentage and you want crit the one thing that you should also focus on a little bit is just a little bit of energy recharge so you can have her burst up time also a mental skill does this little charged mode and once you you know release it you shoot a bunch of pellets that do damage and you need to hit all of them. um but obviously her constellations are going to help especially c2 you can get a lot of crit rate with this this little trial domain thing obviously it's not going to be exactly this way because i think the elemental particles are a little too much here but it's okay because they do give it disclaimer at the beginning go all right now we have her on the burst we do a little bit of this we do this i think we have all the things we do oh and we boom i need 2k that's not bad i think we can do better i think we can do better okay um i think we have enough crystallize going on we do one of these we do one of these Dodge that, we go through this, and boom! We didn't crit. Boom! 136A, just like that. And, um, obviously, her edge being elemental skill, and get him. There we go. And boom! Okay. I think we could have done better. Little Navia Goro. Yurina Bennett team here. It's pretty easy, simply use, right? If you have Yurina, use your bird, use Bennett's bird, and then you can go for a lot. Now you want to collect as many of these crystals as possible. You want to ult, but of course you can use them to skill first. Boom. And you have two of these. The more of the burst hits, the more stacks you get, the more amount of damage that you get to do. So, some pretty easy stuff for rotation where it would be easy to memorize. Sometimes it would be oh, like it would be in your head about your you know East Coast and you should use it and how much crystallize you have or whatever. But it should be fine anyway. 
He does so much damage. I don't have to worry about that at all. Which is nice. And what you want. And roll. Boom. Boom. Oh. You can use your, you know, normal attacks too. He does a lot of damage. So, it's pretty nice. Pretty nice. You got its first look. Oh, you can even just go on this user and let the skills like pretty fast, but I would recommend holding it to you know, get all of the oh. oh. And then boom! Don't oh, worry. This does so much damage to you. No, Boom! Oh, he didn't crit. There we go. Pretty, pretty nice. Alright, so this is why I might not be able to get Navia. Now, I don't have enough to guarantee her. I'm on 50-50, and I only have 42 under Twine Fate. So, I can't even get one 5 star, make it two. So, unfortunately, I will not be able to get her this run. But maybe in her rerun, I'll be able to get her because I really want this character. The design's really cool. Sunglasses, excellent. You do just the fact that you can use a gun. I don't know. It it, it, it rings something in my ear. It makes it makes it nice. It's really simple, easy to use. Just grab crystallized shards and fire them at your opponents. Very easy.